for me to come out to you guys like this with the simple cat showing and a voiceover but for all my for all due regards I'm sorry but I did not notice this until editing right now the camera I was using was giving off a high-pitched hissing noise I don't know if older people can hear it or if it's just me cuz I'm younger I can hear certain noises like that but um I eventually do plan to remake the video but not soon because this camera supports what well, the version of Windows Movie Maker I'm using and not MP4 and I have to go to school to use MP4 versions so uh, yeah and there's going to be one on the Micron XK Roo and about 15 minutes into it, I found out about it, so I haven't decided if I'm going to switch over or continue using the camera, but I'll probably switch over. With all due regards, I'm sorry, and if you don't hear it, thanks. Please tell me in the comment section, and I'll continue using that camera. But, uh, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Hope you enjoy this video. Welcome to Translate DMB. Provided by Underaged IT. Hi guys, and welcome to Underaged IT. Today I have a yard sale pickups video for you. This was not, um, I did not pick this up today, however, I did not go today, how, which is unfortunate. I just need to get some sleep and add some schoolwork I need to do. But I got this laptop, I think. A while ago, maybe a couple of weeks ago, no more than a couple of weeks ago. But yeah, I got I've had this for a while and messing around with it, but it, this is a. Uh, I don't have a tripod. I just have a fan duct. This is just a little mini, mini movie, and uh, yeah, it's a Panasonic Tough Book. And, uh, yeah, it's a, uh, I believe it's from, uh, it's either 98 or 99, but, uh, yeah, this actually competed against what my dad was building at the time, so he designs computers for the military, and this is a heavy duty notebook that, you know, anyway. But I got this and this printer that I'll talk about in just a minute for five dollars. And that big case and other cool stuff that I'll talk about with that printer. So this is an old ninety five Windows ninety five computer. The only laptop version I have because as you can see here I have my big old that out of the way. Windows 95 machine. Just don't want to focus, but just trust me, it's MS 95. And, uh, yeah. So, just gonna go ahead and power this on. Actually, no, I'm not gonna power it on just yet. Well. One neat thing about this camera is it's uh, good to uh, change the, uh, where the screen is located. So no, no, I can't. Um, yeah, I'm just do this as best as I can with one hand.
see here we have come on focus still learning this camera you can see there's VGA serial fan <coughs> pardon single USB infrared parallel yeah sorry I just said dinner um PS2 power there's our card bus slots with the I like the way these work I've got a uh, Dell Latitude that's in near mint condition that's like that yep. we have a floppy drive and I found this floppy in there that so let me turn it on and see what it's got in the front we have the CD drive latch, audio, microphone and here we have the battery which the battery is very is, is interesting I'll, uh, show that in a sec but yeah, side loading battery I uh, don't know to say about that There's the modem. See the modem right there, Blank card, Kensington lock, and we're on to the back. This right here looks like it's a Pentium 3, but I believe it's a Pentium 2. Worn out touchpad that I hate. Keyboard I love. Big screen. See, here we have. Gosh, we'll focus. Let me go back to my using phone, but just trust me, there's caps lock, num 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 key, scroll lock. I'm not even sure what that is. But it's something. Then we have C D drive, floppy drive, and then we have hard drive. Two speakers that are clear, more clear to see in a minute. And they have our power and charging lights. Give me a sec. Can just go ahead and uh, pop. pop these up. Pop these suckers up. Okay, you can see there the speakers. Keyboard I love. And um third black film thing. And, uh, take the keyboard out. The popsicle stick. <coughs> okay, maybe I'm not going to keep one up. Just bleh. But um, I haven't tried getting the processor out. Here's the hard drive. To get the hard drive out. Get out. Oh, I forgot to show the RAM. Got to show the RAM. So I'll show the RAM. Just a sec. But this computer does a is um. Thank goodness it's not doesn't have a password on it. Um, trying to think. Interesting about this computer. 
Um, um, that goes from 95. Um, it is IDE. Like, I was confused from that time. But, Drive Caddy, it's as interesting. I'm not sure. How big is Ah, it's a Toshiba. Yeah. I haven't tried to get it out of this caddy yet. I don't think I will. I haven't tried to run XP or anything on it just because, well, I don't want to ruin a licensed copy of 98. Because the fact is, is that I do not think you can actually, uh, what is it, uh, um, verify online the, uh, when older versions of Windows I'll be back in just a sec. Sorry about that, the hard drive was being temperamental. But, uh, that's the battery, it's interesting. 4.5 amps. Huh. It's a big battery, it's like the size of my phone. Which is, by the way, in a case. A big case, nonetheless. There's battery and there's my phone. And it's not like a Galaxy S phone, it's a it's a big old note. So, um Yeah, that battery's large. <coughs> but so we're gonna just go and power it on in just a second. We can get some stupid power supply in there. <sighs> so the previous owner has some, uh, some personal information on there. Save to disk. Oh yeah, oh, it's got a um, hibernate mode. It's built into the BIOS. And it Ooh, that hard drive doesn't sound so good. Can I come back up? I so hope the hard drive didn't just die. Drive sounds again. And it's it floppy so it doesn't run. It's past the speed up stage. And this person was nice enough to put some custom sounds on here. It's like Play ball! 
the web page has. Oh, it's an actual web page. There's like custom sprites and things. It's got um, one, 128 megabytes of RAM, um, Microsoft 98, Windows 98, second edition, uh, x86 family, model 6, stepping 1. I don't know what that means, but uh, yeah. I think that should be about it for this video. And I've got the printer on top on another one. But, uh... <clears throat> if you would like to submit photos of your computer to be displayed around this time of the video, right as it's ending, please send it to underagedit at gmail.com. No spaces, no dots, no capitals. Thank you for watching this Translate DM Beam production that is produced by Underage IT.